Those that came out, they want to give. Twenty, thirty, fifty, two thousand, one thousand. That you were called and to give out the money. Rise up on your feet. Come out. So the glory of God, I've been able to confirm that God has been so merciful to Genesis Global. Yes, sir. If people are complaining of money and during the service I'm able to tell you, come and give and you run out. I said 50, 20, 100, 5,000, 2,000, 1,000. And you came out. See how when you are around, you walk back, you walk. You pick a majade, a sijade wa. To give your offering, or probably give your tithe. That be komu idame wa abi orere. Not even minding what has been going on in the country. See how see we don't share any lulu wa lulu. But Holy Spirit asks me to tell you. That money you are supposed to give. Some people are going to manage to bring out of the little they have. Some people are here. There are some people living where you live. That, does not, that does not even have money to eat. There are some people in your family that if you send that 5,000 or 10,000 to them, they will eat. Not, not that I'm a billionaire, not that I'm a millionaire. If I should show you my account, no, account now, you will laugh. But listen, common sense. Love of God and love for Christ. Jesus is love. How will I show you love if I tell you even out of that one that is not enough, come and drop it? When all of you run out that you're coming to give your offering, some of you want to give your tithe. This is the question. Is it the right, is this time, is it the right time to excuse money out of you? The money that is not even enough for you. Even if you have. I want to believe that there are some people in your house where you live that does not even have anything to eat. Of course, church money does not belong to a pastor. Now, because you were obedient and you came out. And Holy Spirit asked me to tell you this is not the time for us until this trouble of money, 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 not say money, not say money is over. Forget about offering and tithe in this church. I shouldn't have burden to your burden because I am a blessing, not a burden. Now raise up your hand. I want to pray for you. Because I ask that how many people would like to give money, how many would like to give 50, 100, 20, 10, 1,000, 2,000, and you came out this season that people are complaining there is no money. I speak to your life as a prophet. I speak to your life as a father. Doors we open for you, boy. Amen. Amen. If you are coming on Sunday, if you are coming next Sunday, if the trouble of not getting money is still there, if you can find your way down to the church transport fair, that's okay. No offering, no tithe until this trouble, until this saga, until this hardship is over.